A silly story. I mean, it seems like Richard Dawkins can't quite get it right on Twitter. But with so many butter individuals who get so easily offended, is it any wonder? So here we have his tweet. Islam needs a feminist revolution. It will be hard. What can we do to help? In the Muslim world, not so much the Western world, but still there's problems within Islam in general. Middle East and other Muslim dominant areas, including North Africa, need to have a serious paradigm shift to actually move forward the rights of individuals. There needs to be change. That goes without saying. But on this particular article, you have the idea that Dawkins shouldn't be saying this because he's a wealthy, white, western male. So, apparently, that's the only reason you can't say anything. Why? Because you've got pale skin. Because you happen to have earned your money by, by being a scientist and being an author. Um, you can't go round expressing your opinion because you're not one of them. So I suppose we'd have to all turn to, for an opinion on this, I am Hersi Ali. Is that the answer? We have to turn to her? Oh no, because she's African. So she can't dictate to people in India and Pakistan and Indonesia. No, that would be ridiculous. I mean, let's be entirely honest, people will never be happy with this kind of tweet and this kind of opinion. Simply because there's always some excuse to say, that person should not say that. And Richard Dawkins is not assuming that there is no feminism within Islam, just that it's terribly repressed in a great many cases. And there are vast numbers of women who suffer as a result. There isn't a long history of feminism like there is in the West. So some people have said that Richard Dawkins has not done his research. You've taken a few words off Twitter and presumed that you know points that he is making. So in actuality, what you're doing is not doing your research on Richard Dawkins' perspective. You've got a series of points which are presuming Richard's perspective. You're not actually confirming it. You're presuming things to be the case.